Madge Lake. Here we are at the cabin. Uh, get the skidoo warmed up. Go find a geocache. You ready? Hit the tree! I know, I got a video. To go that way down there. How many more meters? 86. It's saying to go from this path down there. Okay, here we go. This is what used to be the old ski hill. It said on geocaching that, whoa, I'm walking along a dead tree. This is dangerous to have a GPS on the camera. <laughs> That's me wiping out 10 more meters. So that's uh, two geocaches and we found zero. We're off to Benito to find our third. Should be a good skidoo ride. <laughs> Looking at 54 meters in this direction across the lake from the cabin. Two right out there. Okay, so we came upon the large spruce. My GPS is about seven meters or tw seven to 12 meters out of the actual coordinate. Reed found a clue by this large spruce. Broken tin cans. Broken tin cans. Then we dug around and we found the first geocache underneath this big spruce right there. If we zero in on it for the grand opening. What's the name of the cache there, Reed? Geocaching.com. DMPP. DMPY Ecocache. All right, so we're going to get that registered and make an exchange here. Uh, the notebook says that this was planted by uh, ecotourism class in 2004. There's a flag, there's a barbie clip, and I'm taking this eyeglass cleaner. Uh, Reed left a Nomex lace, and I'm leaving a gold strand of beads. Our first cash, thumbs hey. up, and uh, we're out of here, heading home.